So women's long jump final is about to start and one of the main contenders is Serbia's champion Ivana Spanovic looking to defend her title here in Glasgow that she dominated two years ago and that's a big leap in the first round it is valid that's a good jump that classic the way she, she does like that. before she does like to lay out like that but good start the numbers from the backs of the long jumpers six meters 90 for Spanovic Second round, Spanovic to respond to that jump. Three centimeters, she needs to find. Fast on the approach, a little tight though, a little jerky. Dropped her feet in early there, really worked hard. A little bit of forward rotation, pulled her feet down. I just got the impression that Spanovic was trying a little bit too hard in that jump. No improvement. So then Spanovic took the lead with that opening leap, 6 metres 90, but finds herself now in second place. Second jump was a long way behind the plasticine, can push this in harder now and is attacking this. Just pulling her feet down early for me, just I think probably, probably working too hard and then bringing the body down too soon. There and just pulls the knee, pulls the shin back towards the knees. You can add 17 centimeters to whatever distance that was. So 680, 6 meters 80. If she'd have more accurate board, and that would have been close on seven meters. So that was a slight improvement for Mihambo, but stays in fourth place. Spanovic, 690 from that opening jump, chasing 693. Oh, sitting back again. It's going to be really close this again Spanovic Greg Rutherford says she looks capable that's well apparent from what she's done so far she does tend to sit back but doesn't often lose much distance she's trying too hard she's over pushing you can see it through her runway what you want to do I explained it a little bit earlier you want to imagine uh, an airplane taking off so you want to be accelerating into the board she looks like she's pushing the back end of her runway so hard by the time she gets to the board there's actually a level of deceleration so what she's facing is that she can't get quite into position this is why she keeps hitting the back edge of the, of, of the board. back to the long jump though we're in the fifth round now just two athletes to complete this fifth round. The first, Ivana Spanovic in silver medal position with 690, chasing that lead of 693. Oh, that might do the job though. If it's a valid jump, it is. That's a classic Spanovic runway. Bounds out the back, keeps it long, long, long. Shores them up, quickens the cadence and runs off the board. The earlier jumps for me, she seemed to be towing the long jump board. Now she's got a firm plant on it. 6.99 takes the lead. Equaling the European leading jump of Mihambo, who's in fourth place. Greg, what did you make of that? It was exactly what we were, were sort of hoping she would do. She accelerated into the board rather than killing it uh, by, by accelerating too soon. Uh, on the runway so by the time she hit the board she was in the perfect position to really complete the jump and obviously from that comes the distances um, but I've been watching Miambo as well she's had a couple of fouls and actually they've been some really big fouls so there's your long jump distances Spanovic 6 meters 99 a world leading jump European indoor champion defense successful